All right, welcome back to the sweat. That's right. All right, here's what we have. Another two and one night. We don't sweep the board, unfortunately, but 16 and seven is what I see on the season so far. We're cooking. We're making money. We're making profit. It's a beautiful thing. We're doing three, unless, of course, we're jammed with like no games and we had one day where we did two. But other than that, we're doing three games a day here. No or yes run first inning. You're guaranteed to have one of each. Third one, who knows? Who knows? It's up in the air. All right. We appreciate you being here. As always, we ask a couple of things, right? Like hit the thumbs up button and subscribe. This is the best sweat right now going on. I don't care about your first basket stuff or anything that you're waiting on in college or the NFL. Nothing is like the first inning sweat. Nothing. It's a mini game. You've got the top half, the bottom half of this inning. You've got the top third, the bottom third of lineups. You've got starting pitchers who can make mistakes. It's awesome. It's a mini game all in one inning, and that's what we're going to do today. Starting with, let's go to DraftKings. We'll tell you what's going on in DK in just a second here. Over, yes, YRFI. It's labeled over on DK, but YRFI. San Fran, Minnesota. Why not begin there? And it's an earlier game in Minnesota. There's a pitcher on the mound that we have targeted before successfully in the YRFI street. So Joe Ryan is not the guy. He's on the other side pitching for Minnesota, and he's the real deal, right? Like, it's hard to hit against him. It's really hard to not strike out against him. 30.4K rate. The walk rate is non-existent, under 4%. Desclafani doesn't walk anybody either, except he doesn't strike anybody out, and you can hit him. So we're putting a lot. We're getting plus 105 for what should be most likely an even 101 maybe 101 number and we have it here where desclafani goes up against a pretty difficult top third of this twins lineup and even though a couple guys shading towards striking out more often than or just having a higher strikeout rate let me put it that way no major concern here with desclafani not getting smoked or at least giving up a base runner at the very least on the road. YRFI, yes, plus 105. All right, let's keep it moving. Miami, Colorado, this one's pretty easy, pretty simple. We're going to lay minus one. Now, here's what you could do. The play here is minus 145. It's still a good play, by the way, at minus 145. You're less than minus 150, one and a half to win one, which is fine here for us overall. But – you could stretch it, and I, I'm tempted to not even highlight it because then it'll be like, well, you said to play it. No, no, I didn't. But you could ladder this. You very well could ladder this. It's not just Coors Field, which makes a very appealing situation for anybody betting runs or overs in one inning or the game. Carl Kaufman up on the hill, and you haven't seen enough of him to be convinced Meanwhile, it's not like Alcantara is going to get tagged here by any means, but Alcantara could get tagged here. I don't think he's going to get roughed up, but Colorado at home, you make some contact on the baseball, all of a sudden, you got a base runner here, Charlie Blackman hits one out. You know, it's it's not outside the realm of possibility for us. We're just going to go over a half at minus 145. We're playing the ballpark. We're playing at least one pitcher here in Carl Kaufman. We're playing a matchup that does not overpower the other pitcher in Sandy Alcantara from the standpoint of him overpowering the Rockies. Well, it makes a lot of sense here to, to stay with that. All right, I promised you one of each. So we're going to have to go here. Oh, look at this, plus 115. Look at that thing of beauty. This one's jammed in the middle between the two games, so you've got a little more time, but you better get on that first one now. I, I don't get it. Goldschmidt walks. A lot of these guys walk. Arenado, like these guys, well, maybe not Arenado as much, but, you know, Newt Bar, these guys walk. So you've got Ben Lively up on the hill, who, again, very, very limited opportunity to extract anything major here. This is a difficult lineup to pitch to. And I don't care if you're Ben Lively coming back in, like whatever the case may be. And then Steven Matz goes up against the lineup here 
that can put contact, right? Like can make contact, can put bat on ball. doesn't mean that Jonathan India is going to lead off with a home run or anything along those lines, but you've got a couple of guys in this lineup. We just saw this yesterday who can create contact and scoring opportunities. It doesn't have to be home runs. It's also a band box. I understand that. I understand that. But ultimately, Matt's, I think, you may be thinking I'm setting up and over there. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No. You've got too many Ks in that Reds lineup. And I think Matt's is helped by that ultimately. And that's why I would lean towards this. Again, plus 115 is a number that I just want to be a part of. Okay? Now, we're on DraftKings. Very simple opportunity for you. Now, all these other ones, how about for you? All right? What are you going to do? 21 or older gambling problem called 1 800 Gambler. For whatever reason, you may not be on DraftKings. That's fine. That's totally okay. You see how easy it is to build on this. Put five bucks in, bet it on anything, win a buck 50 in bonus bets immediately. You're going to get it right back. So let's see. I mean, what would you theoretically put that five bucks on, right? You can see, you can see, you can find the, the heaviest dog, Charles Schwab. There you go. Because here's the thing. You don't need this to cash. You don't need this to cash at all. So make Ben Raza happy. Put five bucks on Grio. Let's see what happens. here. You're going to get 150 back immediately. You may also win $400. That's not bad. And grio has got a shot at the Charles Schwab. I wouldn't put him on there blindly. Go check out putting for dough in the golf channel all right there you have it that's the DraftKings offer for you i just gave you what to put five bucks on it's super it's easy it's simple now i would be remiss to show you again what's going on here with the odd shopper premium tool this has been updated look at this it is a site of beauty right now it's been updated you can find other plays here you can keep going across the board and find whatever you want oh, i'm not sure why that went out but we'll get back to it all right, so here we go. I'm right here. All odds and bets. I want to go right to EV. I want to sort from EV. And I'm giving you some home run plays, baseball heads. I'm giving you four home run plays right off the bat. These are plot, these are positive EV plays. Rah, and they're beating the market on FanDuel. Meaning, if you play these, you're getting a better number on FanDuel. Amazing how the numbers pop right back up when it's not home run dinger Tuesday. Hey. You've got a bunch of op of offers here. Home run plays. I just gave you a free look behind the paywall. Not bad. And what am I asking you? Take a week and sign up and try it out for free. That's all. Try it out for free. I'll see you today, 4 o'clock, on the Odd Shop with Ben.